blazing room and this is also where we do all of our firing and it's where you'll bring your pieces when they're ready to be fired. So we have this shelf which is where your bone dry greenware goes and this is the stuff that we'll put into the bisque kiln. And then we have this shelf which is after your pieces have been glazed, you'll put them here and then we'll glaze fire them. Once they come out of the bisque, they go here. They stay here for a maximum of three weeks until we throw them away or use them for workshops. So please make sure that you take them away when you see them. And then similar with this, this is your finished work. Again, stays here for a maximum of three weeks until we donate it. But even if you don't like your stuff, please take it away. These shelves get really full, so it's nice to just have them cleared out. So, if I want to fire something, let's say that I'm firing this piece and I want it to be glaze fired. Basically, I come here and I weigh my piece and it weighs 0 0.50 pounds. So that's how much it costs in dollars, 0 0.50 dollars, also known as 50 cents. Um, however, if I'm concerned that my glaze is too low and it's going to melt onto the shelf, then I'll go down here and grab a cookie and I'll include that in the weight. So it now costs 0.74 pounds or 74 cents. Um, if, you, if it's too close to the edge and it gets put in the kiln and it melts onto the kiln shelf, then you'll owe a $25 charge, just so everyone knows. Um, and then I come into this drawer, I get out the July firing fee journal, I make sure I'm recording for the correct month. And then I'll flip to my page. This will be organized by first name, um, alphabetical order. So make sure that you put it in order when you create your sheet. And then it says, full name, Lizzie Curler. Draw or write how you mark your pieces. I put a little heart on the bottom of my pieces. That's important so that we can identify whose piece is whose. Um, and then please write clearly. So the date is July 2nd. I'm firing a cup. Some people like to draw pictures so they can remember when it comes out of the kiln. And the cost is 76 cents, or it would be 74 cents there. And then at the end of the month, I'll send out an email reminder to everyone to please pay your firing fees with a link to pay them. You'll come in, you'll tally all of this up. You'll put the total owed, let's say that it's $20, and then you'll mark what date you paid it on. And then you'll start with the August firing fee journal. After you fill out the journal, you'll take your, pe you'll take your piece and bring it over to the shelf. And then we ask that you load from shortest to tallest and back to front. So this is pretty short, but it's not as short as a plate. So I'll put it maybe back here, sort of towards the middle, but to the left side and in the back.